careful. You got a pet bear? Baby. You giving me a hug? She's never gonna let go. Good morning. I feel like I haven't actually vlogged in a really, really long time. I'm here with Little Miss. My husband, it is actually Sunday. It is Sunday, March 3rd. My husband is at work. He had to go in for a little overtime today to get some stuff done because. His new job is like super busy, they have a really big job. So, he went in for some overtime. He will be back by around noon, it is 9.30 right now. I wanted to do a little like weekend of my life. I didn't get much footage yesterday just because there was a lot of stuff we were doing. Um, I did get some of us playing outside because yesterday, yesterday was such a nice day. If I could speak, that would be amazing. Um, yesterday was really really nice. It was like 70 some degrees. Today's supposed to be like 80 degrees. So today we are going to spend some time outside. We're gonna hang out. We have to go grocery shopping. So I figured let's do a weekend in my life video. So that's what we're gonna do today. And I will add in what I got from yesterday. Just us like hanging out playing outside and everything. But that is the plan for today. I am getting ready to get my daughter dressed and then I'm gonna get dressed and then I think we're gonna go over to my parents house for a little bit just because my husband is gone usually on Sundays we don't go over to their house really and hang out like we do during the week for breakfast and everything but since he is at work um, don't mind the mess everywhere like I said weekends get crazy I've got laundry over here weekends are insane at my house always but since he is at work, we are going to go over there for a little while just because it helps her get some of her energy out. And since we won't be leaving for a while, usually we leave for the grocery store pretty early. Um, if you've seen any of the reels that I've done, we do weekly grocery trips now. So, we will be going to the grocery store. I will vlog as much as I can in there. I still get a little awkward vlogging like whenever I'm out just because I feel like people stare at me and it's it's really weird. I need to do something with my hair. It was so windy yesterday it just kind of messed up all my curls and everything. I might see if my little sister wants to do something with it. Um, she has curly hair. Her hair is like exactly like mine basically and she really likes doing hair so I might see if she wants to figure something out and do something cute with my hair. But yeah, let me get her dressed, and then I'm going to get dressed, and then we will go over to my parents' house. So, I'm getting ready to get dressed, and this is what I'm going to wear today. I'm going to wear these uh, mom cut jeans from H&M. Oh, they're the vintage mom jeans, sorry. The vintage mom jeans from H&M. These are my favorite. And then I'm going to put on this brown bodysuit from Old Navy I think yeah from Old Navy 
and that is going to be my little outfit for today okay so this is the outfit you can't really see too well but brown bodysuit the jeans i also did my nails i don't know if you can really see my nails i did them myself i did french tip kind of in love with them i mean i guess the inside doesn't really matter but i did my nails myself i love them um i just feel are you okay <laughs> i feel fancier whenever i have them done now to go over to my parents house get my hair done and hang out for a little bit so I'm not gonna take you guys with me just because my camera really really needs to charge if I'm gonna take it with us while we go grocery shopping and stuff so I'm gonna leave that here to charge okay it is a little while later this is the hair um, I ended up doing it myself I did not have my sister do it but that's okay I think it looks cute my hair um, I'm still loving it really short but I feel like sometimes I have a hard time figuring out hairstyles to do with it. I'm gonna put you guys over here. I have a hard time figuring out hairstyles to do. I'm not, I've never really been like a hair person, so I feel like I always have a hard time figuring out hairstyles and stuff like that, so. Yeah, it is. 12 14 my husband has not left work yet because he's getting some wood from his job so we can like build stuff here but he has to cut it up to get it to fit into the car so he's doing that so he can bring it home and then if you hear the wind i'm really sorry but it is extremely windy today it's like set 80 I think it's supposed to be like 80 degrees today. I don't know if it's 80 degrees right now, but it's definitely in the 70s. It's supposed to be like 80 degrees today and super windy. So yeah, that's fun. But I did put some chicken in the crock pot for dinner tonight. Let me show you guys. Okay, here is the chicken in the crock pot. I just threw the chicken in there. I drizzled a little olive oil down but then I just threw the chicken in there and seasoned it with slap your mama and let me see I did Lowry seasoning salt seasoned salt not seasoning salt seasoned salt and then some slap your mama and pepper that's all that I seasoned it with I just sprinkled it all over there are four chicken legs in there and I just have it on high and I'll have it in there just until it starts to fall off the bone. This is my favorite way to do chicken now, just because whenever I go to um, peel the chicken off any other time, it's a pain in the butt, but with cooking it in the crock pot like this, it literally just falls off the bone so perfectly. So this is how I cook chicken legs and stuff now. I'm charging my phone right now because it was like fully charged last night before I went to bed so I didn't charge it last night so I'm charging it now and then my husband just texted me and said that he is leaving okay I feel like the warm weather like once the weather turns warm and the sun is out and shining, I have more motivation to film. I have more motivation to dress cute and to do my hair and stuff. So hopefully, I'm sorry, I did not mean to bang like that, but <laughs> hopefully this spring and summer, I can get lots of videos and lots of content because this does make me happy to just like sit here and talk to you guys and everything else. But I really, really want to get lots of content. I do have quite a few videos that we'll be posting soon. I've been doing a lot of fun stuff, mainly just spending time outside with my daughter. But they're cute videos, especially of her playing outside and everything. So I'm so excited. I'm so happy for the warm weather and everything. And 
I'm gonna grab this really quick. One of the videos I will also be posting is a little date night that my husband and I went on where we went to Barnes and Noble and I got this book and we went and had some like pizza and frozen yogurt and stuff. It will probably be up before this video. So I got this book on our date night. I'm super excited to read it. I have barely read anything. Like I started it, but I've barely read anything. Mainly because whenever I read, I have to wait until my daughter is asleep like either bedtime or I have to wait until it's like nap time or something because she will not let me sit down and read even it does not matter like if I try if she's occupied watching TV or whatever if I try to read she will just sit on my lap and like mommy what are you reading will you read it to me and I love that she loves to read I do I absolutely love it I always have to read her a book before bed um, right now we're reading Charlotte's Web so she loves reading and I love that she loves reading but sometimes, you know, mom just wants a little alone time to read her book and just relax. That doesn't really happen, but I have a feeling it's going to take me a long time to get through this. Hopefully not. Hopefully I can do it in a decent amount of time because my husband and I want to make that little date night that we went on more of a regular thing. We want to get a book. We both got a book. He ended up just getting um, The Great Gatsby. He's never read it. I read it for school, but he said he's never read it, so he bought The Great Gatsby, and then I got this, and we're going to read them. He also got Ready Player One, which that one is actually being delivered. He didn't get that on our date night, but he is going to read either Ready Player One or The Great Gatsby first, and then I'm going to read this, and after we are done reading the books, we're going to go, and we're going to go get another book on a date night and just kind of do that to keep things fun and interesting for us just because we both want to read more we feel like we don't read enough we feel like we watch too much tv so definitely recommend going on a date to go get a book go to barnes and noble or whatever bookstore that is around you that you like and then go out get something to eat or you don't have to we also went and got frozen yogurt so you could always go pick out a book and then get some like yogurt frozen yogurt or ice cream or dessert or something we still have lots of fun and i definitely recommend doing that make sure you always date your partner it just makes things more interesting but also just makes it i don't know it keeps that spark alive i guess i am going to make him some coffee since he's on his way home he woke up really early and so he said he needs a second cup of coffee so let's make him a cup of coffee and then we will have to figure out our grocery list after he gets home and then I will be back whenever we are going to the store He's upset because I had to turn the music off. What are you listening to? Kane Brown. Kane Brown. What song? <clears throat> <laughs> he was listening to Bury Me in Georgia by Kane Brown. And he's upset because I can't have it on while I'm vlogging. But we are in the car. We are getting ready to leave to go grocery shopping. I know, you guys don't get to see the fun side of him that I do. He just seems like a very good person. But. <laughs> and then there's a little bug. Sitting back there in her seat. But we are going to go grocery shopping. And once we get there, as long as we don't get blown away, once we get there, I will take you guys with us. trying to find like shorts but not cargo shorts like jean shorts or plaid shorts or whatever but he can't find any that he likes so if anybody has any recommendations on a good place to get some leave it in the comments so that way we can possibly get him some new shorts
good. Look at the nice clean car. We are now leaving Sam's, heading home. It's been a very eventful day. Lots of shopping. Just kind of, I don't know what the right word, what word I'm looking for. Looked, we just looked around, I guess. That's the word I'll go with. So you said the word, you said I don't know what word I'm looking for. Ha uh ha ha, that's not what I was talking about. But we just kind of walked around. And <laughs> I did see a couple of books that I will get eventually at Sam's Club. I didn't know that they had those books there. So I will definitely be going back and getting those books probably next week or the week after. De also, depending on how. What can you see? Um, depending on how far I get with the book that I'm currently reading since I haven't actually been able to read it so we will see I actually have to get a little bit into that book to justify buying another one but hopefully I will get far enough into it in this week that I will be able to get another one and it was really funny because I'm pretty sure I said earlier that I wanted to make our little book date like a regular thing or I'd mentioned it and while we were walking around and we were looking at the books at Sam's Ethan actually was like but we don't want to get all of our books here because I want to start doing our like little book date night once a month and I started laughing because I was like of course we thought the exact same of doing that more often you can barely see you because of the sun drinking out of my cup it's fine we share our saliva other times too so we share more than saliva <laughs> Oh, that's funny. Yeah, baby, I get you water. Hold on. Try to set this up there. Hopefully, don't go for I get this out of here for her. Otherwise, my camera's gonna go flying. Here, babes. You're welcome. Okay, good. It didn't go flying. I would keep it up here. It's just like. That kind of works. Right, it's definitely gonna fall. I go around this curve. It might. So I'm gonna that grab is it again. I also feel like we might get pulled over what? if that was sitting right there. Oh. No, I just meant like you know, if. The car right no, I meant if we just had it sitting yeah, there, right. like on the on the dash the whole I time. Um, I don't think it's this one. I think it's the next one because that one's gonna take you towards Kansas City. You don't want the one that takes you towards yes. Kansas City. Yes. If anybody didn't know, we live near Kansas City, so. I've said too much. Stop. He just needs to get more comfortable with the camera. Once he gets more comfortable. No, you missed the Parks and Rec reference. Oh. I have a lot of money. I've said too much.
I will show you guys all of our groceries, everything that we got once we actually get home. I'll do a little grocery haul at home. And then I will probably, I'll probably end the vlog after that because then we're just going to make dinner and probably sit and relax. And this is just a weekend in our life. So after that, I'll probably end it. This is also not a typical week in our life just because this is the first time he's worked overtime on a Sunday. That normally doesn't happen. Especially with his other jobs, it was usually just a couple, like an hour or so after work. It wasn't on the weekends. So, yeah. I will see you guys whenever we get home. We just got home. It is 6.26 and we spent 110.23, I believe it was, at Walmart, Sam's, and Costco. That was our whole... Those are total for the grocery trip, and I will show you guys what we got. First, we got this pack of water from Costco. We got some sliced pepper jack cheese, some cottage cheese, the Tarani Classic Caramel Syrup, heavy whipping cream, these peanut butter filled pretzels, my husband's Girl Scout cookies that we discussed earlier, <laughs> this Fresh cilantro salsa, which looked really good. So there's that. We got some, what is this, cinnamon raisin bagels. Yeah, cinnamon raisin bagels. Some chicken broth. I didn't notice this. Look at this. Hmm. It's not on the right spot. So I don't, that's going to be fun. Um, some tuna fish. Apples. Cream of chicken soup, lemon pepper seasoning, some cheddar cheese soup, toothpaste for our daughter, mayonnaise, some caramel sauce, hamburger buns, some rice ramen noodles. Of course, the cheese sticks are already opened, and then we got some lettuce. Okay, that is everything that we got for this week's grocery trip. My husband said that the sunset was pretty, so I'm going to see if I can show you guys the sunset. I'm gonna show you guys, we'll try to show you guys the sunset now. I don't know if you can really like see. It's like pink and blue and stuff. And that cloud right there is really cute. That's the sunset. I showed you guys the sunset. I'm going to put away all these groceries now. Don't mind the noise. That's the, oh it's my my dad he's on the four-wheeler sometimes on nice nights he'll go down to the pond and drive around but I'm going to put up all these groceries now and make dinner I will show you the chicken that I put in the crock pot earlier fall off the bone it's perfect so I'll show you that after I put up all the groceries and then we're gonna make dinner and I will close out the vlog Okay, my husband is helping me, but I wanted to show how it just falls right off the bone. I'm barely applying pressure, like literally. Well, I guess the skin kind of a little harder, but it just falls right off. So I highly recommend using the crock pot to cook your chicken. All right, dinner is done. I am closing out the vlog here. If you guys enjoyed this video, please smash that thumbs up button and subscribe to my channel and turn on my post, post notifications so you get notified every single time that I post. If you wanna follow me on any other social media, they are all linked down in the description box. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.